Hey guys, I'm Comet Drill, and you are watching Turtle Time. And today, I'm actually excited for this one. I'm covering character badges. Badges, as a your character or your persona, are great ways to show your character off uh, without not having to wear a suit. Uh, badges are typically headshots, butt shots, aka head and chest. Half body, typically the upper body. There are a few out there where it is only the lower body. Don't ask me why. It just is. And full body. Nine times out of ten, character badges will be made out of traditional art, aka pen and paper, or digital art. Where they'll do it using a computer program and print it up. Then cut out the general outline of it and laminate a hole in it that you can then wear er, on your clothes with a bat. This with a clip. I cannot speak today. <laughs> or on a lanyard like this. And back here. this. Here's, here's a piece of art uh, that I'm using for a badge from one of my friends. And credit somewhere on the screen. Now then, I did say 9 times out of 10 is going to be made materials like that. Digital or traditional art. Right, that's printed and laminated. However, occasionally you will find Badges made of unusual material. So like leather, stitch, it's not the one from Lilo and Stitch. I mean like actually it's sewn in. And do something. Point is, badges can be made out of most anything really. Why do I know this for a fact? It's because I found an artist in that makes custom badges using either leather or a metal edge. And after some work, I finally saved up enough money to order one. Now, my badge, which I got in this box right here, I haven't I haven't even got a chance to see the finished product in my hand yet. You know what it looks like thanks to the pictures they sent me? But that's the difference in Beats Entirely compared to having it in your hand. Alright, so I actually got my badge through two artists. It's the first there's is Millie Griffin and from the Onyx Art Studio. Was, who did the line art? for my badge. And she was incredibly quick and once she actually did get and going with it. And the second artist is Rajin and Sinamari. I'm sorry if I messed up your name. And from Misty Cal Forge Works. Several of their art pieces should be shown here, with credit to the appropriate artists, of course. And links to where you can get in touch with them in the comments below if you want to commission a piece from them. Alright, you open this box, I'm actually going to take my paws off. And yes, I know I'm already poodling. Now, 
Let's see how Forge works. Deals with leatherworking and metal edge. So if you have something you want done in either of those materials, these are good people to talk to. And most badges is that I've seen can range from anywhere from 10 bucks, where you get a simple art piece done, and then you make it into your badge, like what I did, as to actual convention badges, as where they will actually charge upwards to a couple hundred, depending upon the artist. Alright, I think I see it. Yeah. Nope, it's just newspaper. How about this? Nope, still more newspaper. Yeah. I'm not even going to bother with this one. the line art had on the outside of it. Very nice. It got a good nice little heft to it. Especially compared to this. Let's see if I can open it without going crazy. Oh, I ripped the picture. No. I wanted to say that. Now you might be asking while I'm busy unwrapping this, you might be asking yourself now, why I had to go through two artists. Well the one who actually does the metal etching and metal working. I can't draw for the life of him. And so we had to go through a second artist just to get the actual line art. Okay. Oh my truth, people. It's the back of it. And as you can see, there's a hole to so I can put a little clip for a lanyard. Get there. That's a nice fair size. And for the grand reveal. Yay, it's me! It's totally awesome. To get the detail on this, they actually use a mix of rays and depress. The spots on the body are partially depressed, not like the background. And they add little block letters available to spell my name. They even got my little tattoo right. If you look right here, you see them and that was like chicken scratch. Which does actually runic letters aka Viking alphabet. Spelling my name in Viking. Yay! Okay. Alright, so once again, big shout out to Misty How Forgeworks and Onyx Art Studios. Oh, to get this badge today. I highly encourage you guys to check them out. Okay, end of the video. If you liked what you saw and want more, subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Hit that bell for notifications when my next video airs. Leave a like or maybe a comment. 
can't possibly share this with your friends. Alright. I hope to see you all next time. Johnny.